This is God's servant, Apostle Cedric. We began a live session, but we had network challenges, and I had to just record the prophecies for the month of November 2024. This is the 11th month, and it is the month where the Lord wants to establish somebody. Now, the decrees I want to give you here are born of the place of a summon. Now, the strength of a decree is in the dimension and the place it was summoned from. When you summon spiritual entities, what they do is to give you decrees. And when you make these decrees, they become legislations over the lives of people. And so today, I want to make a summon and then make a decree. Manavaiza Zafa Kola Makuvi Namana Anana Zovai. While you're watching this video, make sure you are connected. Sana Kubilisi Samoku Anavu Hubulu Zimanai Anavala Kobenavai Jenny Manavuli Kamani Balai Sana Kubai Namanava. The first thing I want to decree upon your life, the Lord says in the month of November, I decree the peace of God shall be with you and with your family in the name of Jesus. Exodus 14, 14, hold your peace, the Lord shall fight for you. Every time you hear the word peace, it means somebody is put under unrest for another to put unrest. It means for you to have rest, somebody will not rest. When the Lord humbles your enemies, he has to make them to rest in peace for you to rest. Therefore, I make a decree. The Lord shall give you peace in the name of Jesus Christ. Peace in your career. Peace in your finances. Peace in your family. Peace in your ministry. In the name of Jesus Christ. Number two, God says your heavens are permanently opened in November in the name of Jesus Christ. There are people who are under closed heavens. Jesus was under a closed heaven and he met a man called John the Baptist after he was baptized his heavens were open and from that day the voice of God echoed through the clouds and said this is my beloved son there are people here the scarcity of God's voice is traceable to a close heavens I declare and decree your heavens are open in the name of Jesus Christ financial heavens intimacy heavens ministry heavens marital heavens in the name of Jesus Christ number three the Lord said to somebody here, you will experience the goodness of God. I make bold to tell you that many Christians don't know what it means to experience God's goodness. They have heard that God did this through others. They have heard that God did this to others, but to them, it's a mirage. To them, it's a mystery. I want to make a prayer for you right now. You will experience the goodness of God. You know, many Christians say that God is good and they say it by faith and they say it on the strength of God's personality not based on what he has done so I make bold to declare God will do something in your life you will say ah God is good number four decree I want to make upon your life the Lord said there shall be no loss for you and your family no loss of lives no loss of properties in the mighty name of Jesus Christ the Lord preserves all that concerns you there shall be no loss recorded in your life in the name of Jesus Christ you will not lose your mind you will not lose relevant connections you will not lose contact with God you will not lose money you will not lose abilities in the name of Jesus Christ the fifth decree he said the thief will not see you the thief coming out John 10 from verse 10 but to steal to kill and to destroy I declare and decree the thief will not see you in the name of Jesus Christ those that steal joy those that steal peace will not see you in the name of Jesus Christ darkness will not come near you number 6 God says you declare upon your life that the doors that must be closed are closed now and the doors that must be opened are opened now everyone hearing the sound of my voice every door that has to be closed I close the door of sickness I close the door of pain I close the door of premature death I close the door of poverty 
poverty and I open the door of lifting. I open the door of purity. I open the door of fire. I open the door of increase. I open the door of wealth. In the name of Jesus. Samadhi Zaribadai Zanavalo Menangalana Voza Fish Izi Nama Duzi Bizi Balakuba Nanina Mai Anamana Kovai Number seven God said, What you could not get by your power, you will get it by my power says the Lord. I make a decree that where your strength failed the strength of God is engineered where your power failed the power of God is engineered I make bold to declare that the strength of God shall override your weaknesses this month of November what you could not do by power I make a decree that one step shall be a thousand steps one investment shall be a thousand investments in the name of Jesus Christ from today I put the God effect on your steps as you take one step, they shall hear the sound of a mighty army as it happened in the book of Kings where four leprous men took a step and their enemies heard the sound of a mighty army. I turn your feet into a mighty army in the name of Jesus Christ. Number eight, if we will not see you from this month forward, I put on you immunity. I put on you invisibility. You shall be invisible to the works of the enemy. You shall be invisible to wicked people in the name of Jesus Christ. Number nine. Your land shall be fruitful. You shall flourish in the midst of drought. You shall prosper in the presence of your enemies. Many of you here don't understand this. Isaac dug a well in the midst of drought. And water was produced. The Philistines thought it was about the location. No, it was about the man. It is out of a man's belly that flows the rivers of living water. So Isaac was the one carrying the waters. It was not the place. It was the man. I pray for you. Where people say nothing is working, it shall, it shall work for you. It shall work through you. In the name of Jesus Christ. Number 10. You are therefore declared invisible to those that want to waste your time and you are declared visible to your helpers those that came to waste your time you are invisible to them but those that came to help you you are visible to them whatever covered your face from your helpers be lifted from your face in the name of Jesus and lastly you are blessed forever and ever in the name of the Father in the name of the Son and in the name of the Holy Ghost you are blessed God bless you. Confess these 11 decrees for 11 days and you will see the hand of God. God bless you. And I'll see you.